Hi to all guys, uh, I would like to welcome you to France Cat Academy with a new lecture. In this lecture, we will be learning about important points. Sometimes uh, you get a sketch in the form of points or you get space points and then they will help you in making a sketch. So if you get a format like this, which states XYZ and it gives you points, like XYZ coordinates donate gives you a point like a point in space so x coordinate is 0 y 0 and z is zero. it means it is at origin this point is at origin now if you see the second point that is 0 1 0 it means you are moving one unit in the direction of y while 0 0 in x and y are x and z direction so these are points in order to plot these points into solid works, uh, you must use a specific technique. So in this lecture, we will be discussing that technique and these points will be further used in making a sketch. So now we will move further to the SolidWorks software. When we open the SolidWorks software uh, 2015, 2015 and uh, now we try importing this file. We would open. I have this file in the desk, on the desktop by the name points, this point. Now, it's giving us an error that is the following name file that, uh, were invalid, not found, locked or of an incompatible type. Now, how to tackle this problem? Uh, now, to tackle this problem, you will go to SolidWorks adding and you must turn on the scan to 3D option. When you turn on scan to 3D option, now SolidWorks has had the capability to import these points okay now when you turn on this go to open instead of all files you can also go for point cloud files okay uh, now I'll search for points yeah this is the file now you can see the file is imported here now we can easily sketch from these points okay so we can go to sketch you will go to 3 sketch line now we can see that it's highlighting the points we can easily make sketch from these points like this I know this is a very simple sketch but usually uh, we get very complex type of sketches uh, you know to make from these points so that's, that, that, uh, and at that point it comes really handy so we can take many advantages from this command I hope it will help you now we can extrude uh, this sketch also by a simple extrude command Now there is an error. Now, now how will we tackle this error? If we if we get points, we imported them, and then we cannot extrude. So what's what's the advantages? So there is no advantage like this. Now we'll take this advantages. We will extract this advantages from this command. Now how will we do that? We'll do we'll do it now. Okay. So by simple extrude command, we cannot extrude it. Okay, so what we'll do is basically, as we as we have already got the sketch, we we'll go to sketch again, sketch. We'll use same plane. And we'll convert these into trees. Okay, we got a baseline. Now we can convert this sketch. It's okay. We got the same same sketch. Okay, sketch number one. Now, sorry. Now we can extrude this sketch. You can see. So I guess now you people got the advantage of this tool. First we imported the points, then we made the sketch. Now that sketch cannot be extruded. So we extracted that sketch by a command called uh, convert entities. So convert entities help us help us out. Uh, to get this to extract a sketch 
and then we simply extruded it and we can make any feature from this sketch so i hope uh, this command this will help you thank you for watching peace out